Well, the show, or the piece that we're making, is called Things to Come, 1936. And loosely, or generally, it's an attempt for us to imagine what a short sequence of film made by the Hungarian artist Laszlo Mahalinaj for a mainstream science fiction film made in 1936 called Things to Come would have looked like had it been used. So it was commissioned, he built a model, a model to represent in the film the rebuilding of the city, the kind of utopian city. Um, he shot it, and the quote, at least, is that it wasn't used because it was too rich for any, any editor to dare use it. We've got a number of uh, quite well-known published photographs that Maholinage took of the model, but we've also got some unpublished photographs from the Maholinage archive of the set, surrounded by technicians with pulleys and mirrors and so on, so early special effects. Um, and using those, we're recreating something that approaches the quality of that model to then imagine what it is that you might be able to shoot using the model but concentrating on the kind of abstract light effects that it generates. So these sorts of things, the ways that the mirror refracts the light. The methods we're using are um, not just, if you like, in keeping, again, with the kind of spirit in which the original film would have been shot, but uh, methods that have been a feature of previous films that we've shot. So a concentration on the effects of light, and its relationship to film. So one, we're resolutely shooting on film, 16 mil black and white film, using a mechanical camera, hand cranked clockwork camera, uh, using just a simple set of prime lenses. And from then on, all of the special effects are to do with pulling strings or moving lamps or bouncing light from one surface to another. Um, and a lot of speculation, or if you like, guesswork or play. This is a new, um, method in a way but it continues some of the broad ideas that we've been involved with which um, in a simple sense are to do with the relationships between cinema and architecture and the ways that architecture is represented or produced in film.